started driving a K1 is I was used to trail braking. And I think I've talked to you about you this a lot. Is, yeah. Yeah, you it's where you would hit the brakes real they hard and then they slowly they pull like, off yeah. as you get in the throttle. That doesn't work on the car. Yeah, they do that, <laughs> they do that a lot in Irvine. Like yeah. the regulars, the record setters, are trail braking in one turn. All the other record like customers, they don't get it. They don't know how to do it. Well, trail braking at Edison, like, like you said, the brakes are like the way they have the brakes set up. It's either on off. Like you, you can't yeah. trail brake yeah. even if you try. Yeah, you pretty much just use the electric motor. Yeah, yeah. trail brake. Yeah. Yeah. All, right, all right, so, so the first, your first time that came on, right? You were talking about your first time. You're not hitting the times you want. What was the moment where it clicked? Where all of a sudden you look at the board and you got like an 18, you got a 19 second lap. My problem was turn four. It was turn four into turn five, getting turn five. This now this is yeah. old barriers. New yeah. barriers are completely different because the old turn four wasn't it was a it wasn't a hairpin. Yeah. It was a two turn yep. hairpin. So yeah. you had to hit one apex into another apex for what was considered turn four. Mm -hmm. It was a two apex turn. Then coming into a completely opposite direction hairpin turn five, yep. and that's what made it so weird in the old barriers. See, for the me, old barriers you could push them out too. For me, I was, <laughs> I was like, I'm sick of not getting good times. I don't care if I go massive understeer. I'm just going to go as hard as I possibly can mm -hmm. and see where the line is. I did that for like three laps and did the turn properly by accident and said, and it I'm going to copy it. Yep. And I just did that, and I was like, okay, I get it. Yeah. And that one turn dropped my time by half a second. Yep. It was, it was ridiculous. Turn four on that track is so crucial. So crucial. Yeah. I think what, for me, it was um, learning how to flat out like turns two and three after turn one. Yeah. Like just going super, super, super wide. That was my apex. And then realizing I could just flat out the whole thing as long as I kept the grip. Yeah. This guy is throwing everybody's rhythm off. On the new barriers, I remember the first time we were on it. We tried to do it, and each time all three of us were like, Dink in turn three is or dink in turn two and smashing turn three and like spinning yeah, over. Like, what? Yeah, that that yeah. doesn't make any sense. I kept putting the same turns over. I think it was like, I mean, you'll, one, four, you'll seven. still see me do it every once in a while. All my rear tires will just go mm -hmm. dink off turn two and then it will. But you know you got three. it right when you like kiss it a little bit. Yeah, just a little. You kiss, yeah, the rail you kiss it. Spinning. Yeah, you just. Yeah. All right, what about you, Sheldon? When did it click? Oh my God! Well, what, what, what part of the track did it help? You're going out. You're going all the way back to 2014. All the way back, man. Oh my God! <laughs> Lord, honestly, I don't even. I know the hardest part that I had to get was turn three and the back half of the yeah. of the track because I knew, like, when I came in, I don't like. I was I was good, but I like. I didn't know where I was because I was just racing against amateurs. So I did the GP and got fourth, and I was like, "Oh shit!" Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, like, and I think after that point, like every time that I came, I, like a new thing just kind of hit. So like my times just went from you know I think 20s to like 19, 18, 17. It's like seeing it now. It's like shit. Like I can't believe that it, that that happened. So, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I remember I needed help going into four and five. I knew that, and then because I needed help in five, it screwed up the whole back half. Right? Yeah. You mess up five, and then it messes up, it messes up six, six which messes up seven, which yeah. then messes up yeah. eight. One, one through three, I, I got a pretty good handle on pretty quickly, but it was four through the, it was the whole back. I couldn't get. Um, but I kept wanting to get like that 18.9 at least. You know, I was like at a 19.2 for the longest time. I couldn't do it. So I used, yeah, November and December as practice. And um, qualifying, I think qualified like six out of eight. And I was like, oh, okay, I'm not last. And the next thing I know, I had a chance to get third or get fourth. Like I made a couple of passes. And uh, I think it was like, yeah, Ray and Ray and Nicole were just like, yeah, I was like, your second lap, you hit 18.5. <laughs> I was like, oh, wow. I was like, I don't know how. See, but it's, it's better when you like racing with people that <laughs> exactly. that's exactly. quicker than you, so yeah. you can just like completely just follow yeah. them. And that's that's basically where it all I'm, comes in. I'm a chaser. I always, I like getting the pole because you get that bonus point, but every time I was on the pole, I lost it. Now you, you know? see what I'm talking about. Yeah, I'm a chaser. <laughs> Like, Having that extra marker just gets inside. yeah. Like, when you when you are a chaser, a you second. push it a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. A little bit more. Because because shaving off that point zero five because you matters. Can visually, you can visually see like okay, yeah. I'm improving or I'm not. Yeah. But when you just have somebody behind you, you're just like 
Okay, I don't know if it's getting when closer. When, there, when you are in a first, there's a stress of don't push it too hard because what if you mess up? Mm-hmm. Right. And you don't, mm-hmm. where if you're like in fourth or fifth and you're chasing, it's, you know, I don't care that much because if yeah. I, you know, spin out, I only lose two positions. We're going to spin out first. You lose, you know, five, yeah, six, yeah, seven. Yeah, exactly. win. Exactly. <laughs> there's a lot more risk factor involved when you're on pole. Speaking of win, your first win. My first win was a double pass on you and uh, Leo. That's right. That's right. <laughs> and then I won the race after that, and then I was gone, and I won the third race after yep. that. Yeah, unofficial hang yeah. Woo-hoo! And then you climbed up to fifth in points? Yep, from like 10 I, I think I did, I think I, I think it's in one of the videos. Your first half of the year, you're like, your average finish was like 7 point something. Yeah. And then the, the second half was like 1.2. Like <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Over the course of six races, yeah, it was yeah. like 1.2 or 1.3 or something. And then I think your first one, I, I don't remember, I remember meeting you. And you were like, oh, I found you guys on YouTube. And I was like, oh, that's cool. And then you were, you were on the track. But then I remember your first win. I was like, there's no turning back. It was this, this year, right? It, it, was, it, it was December. It was December. Of 17. Yeah. Yeah, it was the championship race. You won. Yeah. Okay. I don't yeah, even yeah. remember that race, honestly. <laughs> He's wearing a black helmet. I remember that. Yeah. He came in the next year with the red, with the white helmet, and I was like, ah, oh, new guy. He's the sting now. <laughs> <laughs> he just comes in with a white suit. Right. right, right. But how'd you feel? Though? Huh? How'd you feel though? Your um, first one. Especially coming in I'm, later in the year. I'm still trying to remember it. Honestly, <laughs> it's a typical like, Eric response. Yeah, I'm just trying not to. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously though, like it's, I don't think it was that eventful of a win. Yeah. I think I remember you. <coughs> I think I want to see you pass Leo mid race, and then you were just gone. And yeah, I think I remember. I remember hearing Nicole say, "I think Eric just passed me." Fair enough. It was like, oh wow, Eric's in front. Good for him. <laughs> While I'm chasing you, I'm yeah. chasing you. <laughs> All right, what about you? Uh, my birthday in 2015. Really? So August, yeah, August second, 2015. First race win. <laughs> Great way to end yeah. the birthday, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, me too. Uh, I know I, I think I got, I don't know if I got pole or second, but I know I did win. I know I did win the race. And that, I don't remember how I won it though. This is so long ago. Oh my god. And then it just kind of like started a trend. Yeah. Until you came along. <laughs> I remember, I remember, so I met you, and then yeah, November, December were my practice races, and you weren't there. And in January, you still weren't there, so I was like, alright, I finished second. And I was like, ah, oh, I thought I had this one. Then the next month, you show up, I was like, oh, like <laughs> And you kick my butt, you beat everybody, and then, I don't remember March, but it was April that year. I finally won. Yeah! And I was, I was so happy, but I was so bummed because Nicole wasn't there because she just started her internship you know, in Florida. I was like, oh, I'm like, hey, babe. She got the race go. I'm like, I won. <laughs> she wasn't here. there. I'm like, I know. <laughs> but that was, that was a good one. That was a good one. I think like every like everyone that has won a race, like, has won more that same year yeah. than the that's next what, year. That's what it was. That, dude, I'm the poster child for that. Mm-hmm. Sixth mm-hmm. place, seventh place, fifth place. Ooh, ooh fourth win, place win, in win, there. Win. Then you get a win. It's just like, win, okay, win the next month. Yeah. yeah. Gone for the yeah. next month. Okay, win the next month, second. Okay, win again. It was, to <laughs> oh me, goodness. it was the barriers that changed everything. And I think I said it in one of the interviews that... Um, that was when I started winning. That was when barriers. you started winning. Was the new barriers exactly? Connor's gonna be uh, definitely a one to win it uh, next year. Um, but I mean, we have a new winner. Leo's still up there. You know, we're, it's the changes in the track really affected everybody's performance. So some of those who were on top are now kind of mid, lower, bottom, um, and so those who were at the bottom are now up top. So barriers are really. Flipped it's because you guys Flipped had. It's because you guys had muscle memory for the old ones. Yeah. And then and me and Eric, for, you know, didn't. We yeah. just knew, you know, what the line is supposed yeah. to be, and we did it. Where you guys are fighting, you guys know what you're supposed to yeah. do, but the it muscle memory right. was taking over. Yeah, yeah it really it didn't. Because right. ter- we didn't know how what to do in turn one for the longest. Patrick was the only person that could figure it out. Mm-hmm. I said, Patrick I is just a wizard. That, Patrick is. <laughs> Patrick is. <laughs> I like watching that kid. He's fun to watch. 
Um, I, I just could not get seven and eight. I couldn't decide whether to floor it, to lift, or to break. I was doing everything. And it would all happen during like one race. And you know, like, after, like, after when <laughs> Eric did, like, uh, lap and I was behind him, I saw how he took, like, turn five and six. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, that's how you do it. If you do it like yeah, this, yeah, yeah. it kind of, like, flows. Yeah, yeah. So after, like, after I saw him do it, I started doing it. And that's how, like, I just, like, lap times. Some of my lap times get a lot better. I find I go super wide on yeah, for fun. Yeah, that, that's like, why I saw not, not everyone does it either. Like, I, for me, it's just like, I gotta get all the way over here because I gotta set up for, like, yeah. three more turns. And if you so it's better late apex now. And I noticed, like, if you messed up turn four, if you messed up turn four, it, it messes up your whole setup to turn five. Mm -hmm. So I figured that out from you. Yeah, so after that, I was like, yeah, I can't get it. Second place, man. Won the next one. And I think I know why no one went wide in turn five. It's me. Yeah. Okay. Move yeah. on, Leo. And then Leo. Leo would do it. You would do it. <laughs> I did it. Hunter was on it. What else? I think that's it. I think that's that was the, really just the three people that would actually do it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Three, four, five. Yeah. Okay. That's like the first is way too scary. <laughs> <laughs> Always the most fun. <laughs> Alright, let's start getting some of stuff out the I way. Get, uh, I get it. Cause, cause keep that, get it as long as you keep fourth behind you, third is great. But then second, yeah. man, it's like you're trying to fight it's for first and defend third. <laughs> second is definitely the hardest. The if you have the right game plan, and I did this twice. I did it to you and Leo. Leo was in first, you were in second, I was in third. And I did the double uh, pass in turn six. Stupid Leo, that's not Leo's fault. Come on, Leo, I need to get around you. Oh, there it is, there it is, there it is. He's got Leo, he's got Leo. Double move, baby, let's go! But we can all agree that most the best drive, the best comeback drive was of course Brian. Oh, he spun out? Yeah, he spun out. Race? Last and then got, yeah. what, second? So yes. Was wow. second. I was so <laughs> mad at Leo. <laughs> at Leo. Leo, I was so mad at you. <laughs> but, uh, but, uh, I remember that. I was, ah. Uh, I was, I was, I was really, really rough on him. Uh, in the beginning of the race because I knew he didn't have a good cart. Right. You know? But I had a great cart and I was like, I got probably you you were yeah you were right yeah, behind me. It was that I, same race. You double took us. Yep. So you were right behind me and I was like I'm still fighting you for points. So I'm like I gotta pass Leo. I gotta right. get this win. I can win this. I just gotta get past Leo. So I was really rough on him, doing my thing, you know. And uh so I finally did the bump and run in four and uh next thing I know I'm like alright I cleared him, I passed him Drive it home, take the win. And uh, going into five, at the corner of my eye, I just see that nose come in. <laughs> that one, it hurt. That one was a hard hit. And uh, I I created a lot of work for myself in post edit because I was swearing a lot. I was swearing a lot. Come on, man. What the that? Some people are saying, man, you kept your cool out of the trap under the helmet. I mean, Audio was not, not cool. Sorry about my bad mouth, man. I was pissed because you took the last podium spot from me. But, uh, <clears throat> no, I took second. Yeah, but took you second. took the last spot because yeah. I was fighting Leo. You were, you, that's right. And you that's right. came in and took me out. Yep. And, uh, no, you passed me in turn four. Five. I, like, I passed you five. No, no, no. It, it was five, dude. It was five. I thought it was four. Dude, dude, it was so good. It was so good. Because sometimes I, sometimes I rewatch races when I'm, like, on the trip or whatever. And that one's just a good one. So I was really yeah. Liking. But, um... She's gonna eat it. Every time it's, it's that lap, I'll, like, go up. I, I catch you guys going into four, right? And I don't even touch you. So you don't know you're behind... Uh, you don't know I'm behind you, right? <laughs> Thanks, man. So I get there right there at now. four. And I'm like, that's perfect. And then you don't have to fight me, so you continue your line. You're not defending. But then I just go on the offense right. and just that. take yeah. it. And then I passed you, and then after that, I was just, Leo was right in front of me, and I was out for blood. I, I worked was blood. so hard to catch up to Leo, and just for you, you to just you pass him like that, I was like, <coughs> damn it. I was yeah. telling Marissa the whole ride, I was like, Brian. <laughs>
It's like I was telling Nicole the whole time. Like, Yo, dude. But like, but now nah, we talked. We talked like the next day or two or something like that. And like we were fine. I'm like, just so you know, this video. I'm not gonna be nice to you in the video. Mainly for content. It's good content. <laughs> it was. But going further, you're like, we'll be all right. <laughs> but uh, ah, dude, and, as soon as I realized I was getting closer and closer, I, I, I could just. I was on top of blood, dude. You know, I put you in the wall in the last lap, coming out of three, and I think I apologized to you afterwards. I was yeah. like, yeah, I, didn't know. I, no, just, no, I was just more focused on Leo than you. <laughs> <laughs> That whole like beginning of this season and the 2017 season, because there was like I mean, it's like when you watch Formula One or NASCAR or something, you see these guys that are traveling around, yeah, and they're yeah, yeah. they're best friends, and then you get on track, You're and like, they're like, I hate this they're guy, rivals. they're rivals, wow. yeah, yeah, yeah. and like that's how we were in like 2017 and you know the beginning of 2018, and then it's like once you get to a certain point, it's like, yeah, one we understand that you know. Like when I tried to pinch you when I got super pissed at you, when I tried to pinch you in turn one, oh I yeah, spun that didn't out. work. Yeah, that didn't work. Well, see, if you're on an actual track, I can try to squeeze you. You'll just go off track, off maybe track. a little bit, yeah. and then probably still pass me in turn three. Right. Well, when there's a wall there, that doesn't yeah, work. It doesn't work. Nope. And I spin out, and you know that's that's where you have to you know learn a little bit. So that that race, that race, we were all ticked at you. We were all ticked at you. Uh, but. You know, we, we understood. We're like, you know, he's trying to defend. I get it. But, like, we're all faster. We're trying to get around you. You know, move. Um, but, yeah, I think, like, a day or two after I texted Allison, and I was like, hey, uh, how's Connor? And she's like, <laughs> ah, he's pretty good. I fed him. Yeah. <laughs> I had, like, five packs of ramen. I'm like, uh, yeah. <laughs> he's good. I fed him. I put him in. No, we're good. I was so pissed at Connor. It's like, when he did that, move, I was like, he f***ed up the whole race. I was like, and I was trying to catch Eric, and then it's like, and then after a while, I was like, yeah, I don't even care anymore. <laughs> Dude, like, the ride home, that was the best part, because he's pissed, and we're in the Mustang, so the Yo, ramp. I'm pissed, I drive angry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was a little you scared, but I was just like. You got a couple uh, exit ramps. Yeah, you got to hold on to that old shit bar, right? The, the we don't have it, so you put <laughs> so your elbow in the there, window. She's <laughs> sitting there with her window and window, you know, arm in the window, and like other hand in the seat, she's just like, I'm not going to say anything because he's angry, and just hold on, I'm just like. <laughs> Driving around like crazy. Yeah, there are times where where I take that first on ramp on the expressway, and Nicole's like, "All right, all right, all right, we're not on the track anymore." And I was like, "I pull over the shoulder, I'm like, we gotta switch. You gotta drive. I gotta like, calm down still." During when he was actually doing it, I was like, "Is that all you can get?" Like, what the f and then he gave me the bottle to take a drink out of. I'm like, "Oh, sh it's gone." It's gone. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, there's it's nothing in gone. it. <laughs> I'm like, never mind. That was good. Like, then. like the whole like the first yeah. time when I did it. Half the bottle was gone. So I was like, I had to shake it some more. And I'm like, why is it not coming out? And I was like, you know what? Because I'm used to seeing like other races where they have like the, the enormous bottles where they can spray yeah, yeah, yeah. it. I'm sorry, I couldn't part. find the enormous bottle of Shanda. You know, <laughs> it would be more fun if you got the memo. I saw it. She sent yeah. me pictures yeah. of like she sent me pictures of like you know Kevin getting the mop bucket out, and I was like. Sheldon, did you tell uh, did you tell him you were gonna do this? And he's like, no, I just did it. I was like, ah. No, I told him. I was like, I was like, do you mind if we do it? He's like, oh, yeah. Okay. Keep it on the tile. And I was like, I was like, do you want me to help you clean it while like like while he was like cleaning it? And I was like, no, I got it. I was like, Are you sure, because I kind of feel bad now. <laughs> that, was, that was funny. That was I love how like keep it on tile, and you, it was everywhere else. But I hit the car. Was on the demonstration. I was on the wall. I know. I'm like, I'm like watching these interviews, and like he's in the background, like mopping the floor, <laughs> moving the car. And I was like, oh poor Evan. <laughs> oh man. I even because somebody like, wanted to move out the way. I was worried. Oh man. yeah. Is it? I was like, never like, and there was like. Do the championship celebration, champagne, you gotta do the GP, man.
I can't wait to do a blooper reel. Most of them are going to be Rachel, like... Have to be interviewing somebody, kind of eyeing the camera, eyeing behind you, doing this. <laughs> Making sure people don't cross. Or when they do, she's like... <laughs> 18 Grand Prix Challenge in Addison. And thank you, Leo. <laughs> <laughs> The track is still a little warmer, so we'll see, I guess. <laughs> oh, nice. Good luck, Brian. We'll miss you. Ah, uh, you guys suck. <laughs> Connor sort of helped me out there. Pushed Leo out the way, so I had uh, a smooth, smooth pass. <laughs> the front tires had no grip at all. <laughs> <laughs> front tires had... Come on, Terry, I hate you. <laughs> Hello, this is the 12th race of the 2017 Grand Prix Challenge of Addison. This is before your Titan points with Connor. Or, you are Connor. Hi! Oh, now you got new trophies? Yes! I win last month, I don't get a cool trophy. I want one from last month. Yes, okay, sure. <laughs> exactly. Show me the trophy. Okay, so you got your trophy. Yeah. Okay, so Good evening, I am recording live from the K1 Speed Track in Addison for the 8th race of the 2017 Grand Prix. Alrighty, this is Rachel Elaine, not reporting live at K1 Speed in Addison. Oh, that's always fun. You know, winning is always fun, so... winning should be fun anymore. Okay, let's meditate, okay? So starting from your head, feel your thoughts. Don't look over here, okay? Close your fucking eyes. Keep them closed. We're meditating, okay? K1 Speed. No, you have to be shorter. Get short. Thanks, Eric. Appreciate you letting me get second this time. Thank God. <laughs> now I want you to tighten your muscles in your legs and then release. Tighten and then release. Releasing all the tension that you feel in them after every release. You know, I ain't gonna help you no more because you're an asshole. And you ugly. I love how you're like being helpful but being an abuser at the same time. <laughs> We're gonna have to cut this part out for sure. Gotta fix the long locks. Yes, gotta look gorgeous for the camera. Exactly. Tell me what's happening behind me because it's gonna be crazy. Yeah, they're literally like on your butt. You're like a, you're like a man sandwich. You're like a man sandwich. I don't know. I don't know. Stefan, how are you doing today? Fine, how are you? How, how is spotting? Any like fun tips that you give Connor? Yeah, I always watch out for the blue turtle shell. I tell him like, hey, Sheldon's gonna pass you, but Sheldon passes him. Because the front tires won't want to grip as you know once it starts to get cold. So uh, for now, just stick with the excellent grip we got, but for uh, for later, we gotta have to get back into learning understeer and stuff. Welcome back. This is the final race of the 2017. Thank you. <laughs> Did I say? Oh no. The dining room ride deserves a sign. Assembly. Then it'll be self bliss. Is that good enough for you? You want me to sign it up for that? You can't really care. We're going to try this. We're going to try this again. Take three. Take three. <laughs> Take three. <laughs> the, the beard kind of confuses everything. Oh, what the? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you want to give me the second place, there you go. That's even better. <laughs> but, you know, nothing's better. Than I saw you uh, practicing on the track beforehand. Oh, you now have a Hershey bar. Hershey bar. How do you feel about that? I mean, that, that's pretty good. It's going to give me a boost on the track for the race, so. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad. Yeah, we're not sponsored by Red Bull. <laughs> but it's delicious. <laughs> I'm always like, Carhartt, Carhartt, please. Like, please.
strikes again We are the kings of the weekend